Welcome to your weekly technology segment from the NASDAQ Market Site. Students and parents are busy basking in the sun, but also gearing up for the back-to-school season. Meanwhile, the upcoming Apple and Samsung events, as well as the IFA Consumer Electronics Show, have many worked up over potential gadget news. Now, not surprisingly, the rumor mill is on fire. The rumors run the gamut from hardware to software news. And many tech companies are reportedly working on a smartwatch. Now, according to the latest report, Samsung's version of the smartwatch will be called the Galaxy Gear and one on the Android OS. While Americans take a break during the Labor Day weekend, Samsung is expected to be busy prepping for the announcement. Now, Samsung will reportedly make an announcement on September 4th. There has been plenty of speculation over wearable gadgets, and it's too soon to say how excited consumers will be about these devices. And the countdown is also on for Apple. On September 10th, the company is rumored to announce an affordable version of the iPhone. The company could also unveil the update to the iPhone 5. And in terms of other updates, a new finger print detecting technology could also be on the cards. And we will all have to be patient and see what comes out after we reach the other side of this month. And on to other tech news, Sony and Viacom inked a preliminary deal to stream cable channels. That is right, Sony will bring Comedy Central, MTV and Nickelodeon shows to living rooms over the internet. While a definitive agreement has yet to be reached, Sony is planning to provide a streaming pay TV service. This would offer consumers yet another alternative for content. Now the company will need to hash out more programming deals. Sony would offer its service through its devices and gaming consoles. Now sources do say that the service could be launching sometime next year. And that does wrap it up for your technology segment from the NASDAQ Market Site. Thanks for watching and have a great weekend.